Excitement levels have certainly been ratcheted up here at Turf Moor. I'm Derek Ray at the microphone, and joining me for match commentary is Stuart Robson. And very much looking forward to bringing you action from the Premier League. It's Burnley taking on Liverpool. Well, thanks, Derek, as always. The scene is set, two good teams, a great playing surface, and a vibrant atmosphere. It has all the ingredients for a really exciting game. Well, Mo Salah knows how to light up any game, I think it's fair to say, Stuart. Well, Derek, his outstanding attribute is his pace. Not just over the first few yards, but over longer distances as well. And that makes him so difficult to play against. Defenders are unsure whether to get tight or drop off. A dynamic player. And this is the initial 11 for Burnley. Nick Pope gets the nod between the posts. James Tarkovsky plays alongside Ben Mee in central defence. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And this is how Liverpool start the game. Alisson begins in goal. Virgil van Dijk plays alongside Joel Matip in central defence. Sadio Mane starts with Mohamed Salah out wide. And rather than use a strike partnership, they've gone with just the one player in attack. And the game begins. Jota and just narrowly wide in the end and well, tackling like that the onus is on the referee to take action potentially so we have an early booking here to report, Stuart. Yeah, and I think the referee's absolutely right. He's just making it clear to all the players out there he's not going to take any messing about here. Goodmanson. Now with Weghorst. Doughty defending to win the ball back. Diogo Jota. Well, the counter chance looks very real. It did look on for them, but not to be. And that pass could be troublesome. And reading it absolutely superbly. And he's through here. Well, it didn't worry the keeper. Me. Taylor with it. McNeil. And the snuffing out of the cross there. Salah. Diogo Jota. Henderson has it. Henderson. In towards Salah. Oh, terrific piece of goalkeeping.
He's driven in the corner. Relatively straightforward to mop up defensively. Salah! And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Josh Brownhill. Brownhill. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. They need to get bodies back. McNeil. Superb block. This is a message for Adriano Negri. Happy birthday, Adriano. And have a fantastic day from the Well, they've Adriano. lost the ball. Veghorst. And an astute piece of defending. They've got it now, what can they do? He's got the right idea with that pass. And a goal! Now they have their opener, and now they can celebrate. Well, here it is again, and you have to say the 1-2 completely opens up the defensive structure. And it's a good run, matched by a very cool finish. What a great goal that is. And Liverpool get the ball moving again, looking to find a reply to that setback. McNeil A running room in the wide position oh surely well somehow the goalkeeper got to it and there's the delivery Well, it came to nothing in the end. Matip. Diogo Jota. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Andrew Robertson. Showing considerable guile. An alert piece of defending. Really a very poor ball. It is to be a throw-in. Ben Mee. James Tarkovsky. Brownhill, Ashley Westwood on the ball, not a good pass, Mane, here is Thiago, Diogo Jota, Thiago, possession and patience, the watchwords, and this is Diogo Jota now, this looks more than decent, Oh, good work by the keeper. Charlie Taylor. So almost at half-time, and they are making good use of home advantage. Still a bit of work to do, though. Stuart, your thoughts on what you've seen? Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going in at half-time if it stays like this. Now well, there to intercept. Chances on. And turned onto the woodwork. 
Priority was to hang on to the ball, which he did. Mane, Diogo Jota. And the whistle is sounded for half time in this game. Hasn't quite happened for Sadio Mane, has it, Stuart? Well, as you can see, he just hasn't had enough touches in the key areas. And that's one of the reasons they're losing this game at the moment. As anticipated, plenty of talking points so far. And now the second half is underway. Charlie Taylor. McNeil. Couldn't keep the ball. They're not giving their opponents any time to breathe. Can they hit on the break? But a good piece of defending to bring it to an end. It's a good-looking ball in behind. Oh, but he's done brilliantly to cut it out. Diogo Jota. Fabinho. Real chance. And denied by the keeper. Impressive. Maxwell Cornet, untidy on the ball. Henderson, he's in with a chance. Oh, dealt with by the goalkeeper. So making the substitution now. Number 14, Jordan Henderson, coming onto the pitch. Number seven, James Milner. Let's see about the delivery. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. James Tarkovsky. Oh, what's he gone and done? Well, getting in the way, superb save. Here it is now, a substitution. Number 20, Diogo Jota. Coming onto the pitch, number 9, Roberto Firmino. Corner kick played in. Well, perhaps not a high percentage chance for him. Well, although he was always going to be second to the ball, the defender just about did enough to stop him getting a clean header there. Wout Weghorst. And into the last 30 minutes now. And it's a quality pass. Mane. Liverpool throw in here. Well, they've been getting the substitute ready, and now they will make the personnel change. Now he must favour the cross. Robertson. And the counter looks on here. Options available. Will it be sufficiently imaginative? Opportunity it is. And the keeper has denied him. Well, I've got to say, Derek, he was always in control of that situation. Brilliant stuff. Matip.
Brown Hill. Useful looking position, you've got to say. Will he find the net? And the keeper had the measure of it. Can someone get on the end of this? Well, no real accuracy and easy for the keeper. Did well to win the ball back. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Will they profit from this situation? And they'll regard that as a very disappointing end to the move. Well, pressing really high. Now, let's see what they can do here. And offside, unfortunately. Just 15 minutes remaining. Roberto Firmino. Fabinho now. Well, he had to read it and get there and did. Brownhill. McNeil. Veghorst, untidy in possession. Breaking at pace. And an example of a counter-attack that went nowhere. It did look on for them, but not to be. And unable to pick out a teammate. And that'll be a throw. Charlie Taylor. Well, there's still scope for late drama here. Five minutes left and just one goal between the sides. Well, it's almost over, but not quite. The fans still with a bit of nail-biting to do, Stuart. Well, it's going to be a nervy end to this game. But if they do hold on, I think they've deserved their win. They've played really well and they've played some good attacking football. And in general, they've controlled the game. Tremendous ball played through. This could finish it. And in all likelihood, that is game over. So little time left for a response. Well, let's see this again. This is counter-attacking football at its very best. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Well, a second goal for them here. The electronic board has been held in the air and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Flag up, tight offside. And room now out on the wing. Now let's see about the cross. And a no-nonsense clearance. After the foul, a chance to contemplate what is next and perhaps a goal from this free kick.
Now that short pass, this could be interesting. And there goes the final whistle. Not what Liverpool fans anywhere wanted to see. It's a defeat for them. Your assessment? Yes, Derek, they were well off their usual standards today. And with the quality that they have in their squad, I think it's fair for the fans to demand more. Too many bystanders for me, just not good enough. Well, no getting away from it. A standout performance from Van Weghorst. He really turned on the style, Stuart, didn't he? Well, I thought he was excellent. Not only did he score a good goal, but his general play was outstanding. He certainly played a major part in their win here today.